how to create graphs in Google Sheets and put them into your documents. So to get to Google Sheets, you can just Google Sheets, log in on your account, create a new blank sheet, and you can start to put your data in. I'm going to look at how does the amount of sleep I get affect the test score that I get. Here is me just making up some numbers just to show off how to do it. Notice that I have the units in the column. Select both columns, insert, chart. You will get a chart. Mine came up as a scatter chart. You might get a line chart, but I recommend using a scatter chart. I see a lot of you use column charts. Do not use a column chart if the independent variable is not a number. Look at the x-axis, it doesn't even make sense. The numbers aren't consistent. So don't use column charts, use scatter plots. You can customize this, go into customize, you can change the title. Just give you a little demonstration how to change the title on the axes, the axis labels. So we can change hours to hours, notice it changes on the graph itself. Or if I want to change the vertical instead of percent like typed out, I can just use the percent symbol. Notice it changes on the graph as well. How do we get a best fit line for our data and its slope? We need to go into customize, go to series, go down to trend line. That's what you want a trend line. There's your line, but it doesn't tell you the slope of the line, that's what you want. So go to label, tell it to use the equation. And now you can see that the slope of your line is 13.8. That's what you want to know. What do I do with this graph once I've made it? How do I put it into a doc? It's easy, you go edit to copy, create yourself a new Google Doc, and then just choose edit paste. And if you have a graph as a part of your regular document, you can type around it, move it around like a normal object in a document. If you want to put your graph into a Word document, it's a bit more work, which you three dots, tell it to download as an image. I recommend using PNG file is saved somewhere as a PNG image. Then in Word, you have to click Insert, Photo, Picture from File, locate your image, and then just click Insert. And now it will be a part of your Word document. Hope this is helpful. Have a great day.